All right, you guys, hope you're doing well. Here we are in our work week. We're in the middle of it. It's so much fun, guys, but it's a grind too sometimes, okay? So don't let anybody shine you on and be like, it's all unicorns and rainbows. No, it's not. The telemarketing space is a great place to be. You can do phenomenal things, okay? It's like Star Trek where you're just transporting yourself all over your state. I'm a big proponent Okay, I run my own agency. The people that work with me, I always give them the same advice I take myself. Super important, work one region, work one state so that you can kind of take care of it. You're the local person for the state of whatever your state is. Okay, it's a big thing. Work your own region because I'd rather work with someone that works and lives at the same state that I do. Okay, so maybe that's just my bias, but how I feel. So I hope this helps you in some way. But focus on what you need to do. In this particular work week, I've been able to help 10 people so far in three days. 10 sales, three days. It takes work. It takes effort. It takes intention. And it takes listening to the consumer, understanding their needs, and being sensitive to what their budget is. A lot of people try to get the highest AP. My AP doesn't suck. But guess what? It doesn't suck because I ask my clients, the prospects, okay? I ask them, what's comfortable to them? I don't wanna stretch you. I do the opposite of every other commission hungry person on the planet. I do the absolute opposite, okay? I go way low and say, if you want more coverage, just tell me, I'll do it for you. Do you want more? I got you, okay? Focus on their needs. Be sensitive to their budget, you guys. That is super big in telesales. Don't be worrying about, okay, oh, it's a small sale. It's just as hard to make a small sale over the phone or in person as it is to make a big sale. Big or small does not matter. You need to be counting the needs, the needs and the problems that you've solved. This week, three days, I've solved 10 problems. I have guarded 10 families, 10, okay? 10 in three days. That doesn't suck. But bottom line is, you guys, I'm taking care of people. I'm meeting their needs. I'm taking the burden of final expenses of legacy money being given to future families. And I'm solving those problems because I'm being sensitive to the clients. I'm listening to them. I'm being intent on their wishes. Clients don't care what you want. Figure that out real quick. Clients care about what they care about. So you better be sensitive to listening and honing in to what the client wants. Solve the client's wishes. Solve the client's concerns. Bleak. But just saying, solve that. Meet that need. Listen to the client's problems. If you listen to them and do what they want, you're an order taker. Okay, if you're trying to put a square peg in a round hole, you're a salesman and you're annoying. I don't wanna to listen to you, now that it's half the world. When you call, they wanna hang up on you anyway. In the telesales space, you need to be doing everything client focused, okay? Get yourself in a place where you're ready to listen. Shut your mouth. It's tough. There's times where you wanna talk and you gotta be like, Arr. okay? When you're doing the telespace, just like in face-to-face, -face, shut your face, listen to the client, ask questions, and be quiet. Listen to them. Listen to their needs. And then take notes and say, okay, it sounds like all you want is to take care of cremation. Is that correct? You want enough life insurance to pay for cremation tax-free through a whole life insurance policy? Would that meet the needs of your, you know, your family? To be able to, if I can provide five to $10,000 of coverage, would that be sufficient to pay what that will cost now and in the future? Well, that's like, yes, it is. Awesome. Can you afford? Okay. And put out the premium. If that's okay with the client, you have gained permission to move forward. If you have not gained permission, you're going nowhere. Okay, just like my kid. If he doesn't ask permission, it's not great. Okay, let's just put it that way. As a dad, it's not great at all. 
So ask permission with your client. With permission, you have consent. With consent, you can move forward. You guys, this is big. If you need help, like, subscribe, reach out. I hope you're doing great this week. It's so much fun to meet needs. It's also draining at times. Don't let anybody fool you. If you're working hard, okay, I got up early, took care of a bunch of people. I listened. I was doing a bunch of service work today. I'm still at 10 needs met in three days, okay? But that includes 30 minutes on phone with a carrier solving a billing issue. No big deal, but the client knows if they call, my client comes before a prospect. My client's first, always, front of the line, boom. My client needs me, you take care of your client. Even if it's some stupid service work, it's not stupid. Without that client that you sold a while ago, there's no you anyway, okay? Get your priorities in order. Take care of that client, meet their needs, handle the service work that you need in real time, right away, don't neglect them, and then go back to prospecting, right? You're gonna get referrals. I got two referrals today. Off telesales, you guys, two referrals today. Off being a telesales agent because they understand that I care about their budget. They understand that I care about meeting their needs, not my needs. When you get that alignment in order, everything's perfect. Is it fun? Most times, yeah. But it's still hard work, you guys. You gotta just roll your sleeves up. You gotta go at it. Nothing easy in life is going to be great for you, okay? Hard work, though, is going to get you where you want to be. Skilling up, training yourself to be the best is going to get you where you want to take your career, where you want to meet the needs of your consumer. And that consumer is going to feel the fact that you understand what you're doing because you've been trained well. You have the best A-rated carriers and you're driving yourself with forward purpose, forward momentum, furthering that client's objective, the client's objective, not your objective, okay? So get yourself into a place that you're ready to go. Here we are, 10 sales, three days. If you need help, like, if you could do me a favor, if you're watching, subscribe if you're not a subscriber. I'm gonna put out some good stuff in the future and I'm gonna hopefully be dropping stuff that's gonna be helping you. So I hope that I'm bringing some value to you. Have a great day, have an amazing tomorrow, you guys. There's two more days in this work week that you can just take care of people, okay? Take care of your business. This is your business. Nobody cares more about your business than you. And if you work for an agency, they should be investing in you, time, intention. They should be helping you progress in your career to the point that you can be on that next level. If you're working for an agency, I hope they're loving on you and taking good care of you. And if you're one of those people that just needs to be left alone, perfect. Hope they're giving you your space. But if you need help, reach out. Help in any way I can. Okay? Have a great day.